we really do wish you happy many returns. We see the uh, CEMB as a family group. We have common issues, therefore we have common goals. Probably just as many members of the CEMB, uh, like several of us from the LBA, are from religious background, religious societies, and most likely fundamental background. We're from societies where free thinking, secular views are unheard of, and members face being um, outcast in their families and society for changing their thoughts and beliefs. We congratulate the CEMB for creating and maintaining a space for um, ex and non-believers. At the LBA, London Black Atheist, we stand by you in your demand for universal rights and equal citizenship for all. We stand by you in opposing cultural relativism and in opposing the tolerance of inhuman beliefs, discrimination and abuse in the name of respecting religion or culture. We stand by you in seeking freedom to criticize religion, in prohibition of restrictions on unconditional freedom of expression. In my day job, uh, as was said in the introduction, I'm a migrant justice advocate. Part of what I do, as much as I'm an atheist, I represent people fleeing persecution because of what they believe or what they do not believe. Just like members of the CEMB, I believe very much in the freedom to have and practice religion, and I will continue to defend the right as much as I can for the right to believe and to disbelieve. I will continue to fight to have a world that is safe for believers and free thinkers and disbelievers. We stand by the CEMB side by side in the world to prohibit all restrictive and repressive cultural and religious customs, which hinder and contradict women's independence, free will, and equality. Well done for all you've done in the past eight years and several many years to come. But my hope is that one day we won't have to exist. I hope that one day there will not be a need for CEMB or a need for London Black Atheist because we will live in a rational world and it will be a free world. Yeah, yeah, yeah.